After a decade-long trek across the solar system, a European spacecraft named Rosetta is about to do something none of its predecessors have done before, orbit a comet. On Wednesday, August 6, the European Space Agency's ESA Rosetta spacecraft is expected to arrive around the nucleus of Comet 67P churyumov gerasimenko ending a 4 billion mile, 6.4 billion kilometers journey. For the mission's controller, the historic rendezvous will mark the end of a careful years-long game of catch-up. Rosetta launched on March 2, 2004 and was steered through several gravity assists around Earth and Mars. These loops helped Rosetta speed up to get far beyond the orbit of Jupiter near Comet 67P churyumov gerasimenko But since May, the spacecraft has been slowing down. According to ESA, Rosetta needs to get within just 2.2 miles per hour the pace of the comet, which is currently traveling at about 34,175 miles per hour. A series of controlled thruster burns in May and June alone slowed Rosetta by 1,500 miles per hour, 2,400 kilometers per hour. ESA controllers conducted those maneuvers on a weekly basis in July and have planned just two more short insertion burns for August 3rd and August 6th to get Rosetta within 62 miles or 100 kilometers of the common surface. Rosetta is carrying a small lander named Philae designed to touch down on the comet nucleus in November so that it can take samples and conduct experiments. The spacecraft will stay with the comet as it travels around the sun.